What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Devonta Harris back with another video. We are back with the extreme content making. No, I'm kidding. It's it's not it's not that extreme at all. Okay, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be completely honest with you guys. I do apologize for not uploading as much as I could or as much as I said I was going to. I thought that recording my daily life was going to be super eventful, more entertaining and stuff like that. Once you realize you have all this content, you start editing, you're like, this shit is boring. There's not really anything going on. So what I plan on doing now is giving you a weekly video. Every Saturday I will be uploading. That's a promise, okay? And then from there, I'm going to record my journey throughout the week. So you get a week's worth of video in one video or week's worth of videos in one video. I think it's gonna be much more eventful. It's all gonna be units. It's not gonna be like too random. It's gonna revolve around the printing, the business making, all kinds of things like that and going from there. I think that's the best way to do it. That way I don't overwhelm myself and then I don't let you guys down like I've been doing because I've been wanting to record, but it's just been super, super difficult. You become unmotivated because you're just filming and filming and then you have all this content that you have to siphon through and all this stuff. And then it becomes, like I said, it becomes a chore to the point where it's not fun, you know, and I can doctor it up, make it look nice and what and all that stuff, but it's not fun at the end of the day. So I promise this time it's gonna be consistency, one video a week until we have enough time to do more. But for now, every Saturday is a new upload. So thanks for following. Thanks for the continued support. People still comment to this day. I still get continuous subscribers that's growing on a daily, which is awesome. But we're just gonna hyperdrive this and give you guys the full experience. Like I said, a week's worth of videos in one video every Saturday. So that's what I'm gonna do for you guys. So today I'm gonna take you along what I've done today and go from there. I'm gonna post this video today. So when you're watching this, this is current, this is current me. I'm gonna drop this video with today's events going forward. We closed a $4,700 deal yesterday. Insane, my reaction was just like, ah, oh, you know what I mean? I wish I could have recorded that, but it, it literally just happened. But we made $4,700 yesterday. Obviously that's not all profit, but you know, it's things like that, you know, like the sale was great. Now we got to put in the work. I will let you know what's going down. Thanks for sticking around. I appreciate you guys. Peace. So the day started off strong, but I started feeling like shit. So we're going to pick it up tomorrow and see what happens. The next day. This is what's going on in the lab right now. I am extremely sick, but I'm still gonna film. But we got these boxes right here full of shirts. We got shirts on the table right here that need to get printed. Shirts over there that need to get printed. We just gotta straighten up a little bit and we're just gonna get after it. Just try to give you my all today. I am so, so, so sick. It's like the type of sickness that like comes and goes. So it like, it'll like shoot me down for like two days. Yesterday was terrible. I mean, today, I'm just gonna try to like release all this this mucus and shit like that just to, to to prosper through the day. So we got a lot of things to do today. We got this Mewtwo hoodie right here that I'm gonna do. I designed this Mewtwo piece and I'm going to embroider this guy right now. So let's get after it. So I would show you guys the, the starting of this, like pressing it and going, but I actually filmed this portion on my TikTok. So you'll see this video on TikTok as well, just the, the bit of the hoodie making, um, but you'll see it in the background constantly today as it's getting worked on. All right guys, so we got an update. The transfers that I ordered actually got shipped to the wrong address. So I need to go pick these up. And then also I need to go pick up the transfers I'm sorry, I need to go pick up the order from my screen printer. We outsourcing some things because it's easier to handle certain loads with different forms of printing, if that makes sense. So give me a second. I'm gonna take you along the journey and we are gonna go pick up these shirts from Mark from Planet Tees. All right guys, so now we are on the road. We are gonna head to the post office first to see if we can intercept this package because it was delivered to the wrong address which is unfortunate because this should have been here like two days ago so again delays 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 and that happens with printing it's a completely okay it happens and then we are also headed to mark's planet tees to pick up a screen print order sometimes you have to outsource some things like i said previously to get things done correctly because dtg can't do everything however you know times will change and things are getting better but for right now what i do i outsource the screen printing and my buddy mark is pretty cool if you're a screen printer and you print though if you do some good printing, you can give me some good prices. Let me know. Hit me up in the comments down below or send me an email at info at primaryprint.co. There it is. Thanks. Oh. Yeah. We're pulling up right now. Yeah. Yeah. All right, buddy. 
Mark's dog is is on the property. Oh, hey buddy, hey buddy, hey buddy, what's up, buddy? What's up, buddy? What's up, buddy? Your boy needs a haircut, man. Ooh, badly. So here it is, Planet T screen printing. This is Mark's company, and he helps with my screen printing. And it's cool because he built this whole shed on his property and he turned it into his business, which is super, super sweet. But I don't want to show too much of his house because this is his property. <laughs> I wasn't sure you were in here because it said clothes on there. Yeah, because I'm, I'm like starting to film again on my, my YouTube channel. So I was like, I was like, I'll, I'll, I'll like show them the outside so I can help your business. I was like, I don't want to show too much of the property because this is his house, you know? <laughs> this is Mark's shop right here. This is, you built this, you built this shed? Yeah. yeah. Built the shed from scratch, yeah. Oh my God, and yeah, so this is where she, he gets all the magic done and everything right here. This is Planet T's and he's got like this whole alien theme going on right here. <laughs> super, yeah. super awesome. 10 years, we're a little crowded. Yeah, hey, no, but that's good though. These are the shirts that we got made right here. These look clean. All right, bro. Thank you so much. Yeah, you want me to close this? Yeah. All right, bro. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. All right. So we got the box right here. Shirts look good. Now we have to go to the post office to see if we can intercept that package. So I will see you when we get there. All right. So we're at the post office. We're gonna go inside right now and see if we can get this package. crazy thing is i don't even know if the package is going to be here that's the crazy part all right so it wasn't at this address so we wasted like 20 minutes but it's okay hopefully we can get this package today still this way come on but we're going to go to the main the main usps hub so hopefully it's there so we will see you at the next post office hopefully it's not too busy there if it is i mean it is what it is we're on a mission today to just catch up on things yesterday i didn't do anything so i was feeling like shit because of the sickness, but we are going to head over there now. So we'll see what happens. And just like that, we got the package, we intercepted it. Now we can go home and get this work in. The lady was, she was literally about to say, oh, it's not here. Um, we have to uh, go to another location. I was like, well, can you just check, please, please. I didn't want to film too much because I've been already filming. But yeah, we got the package. The package is right here. This has the transfers and stuff in there. I can get a lot of work done today with that package. So we out, let's go do it. All right, guys, so we are back home. Let's go ahead and start shipping out this one box. Uh, we're gonna request a pickup. I believe it's not too late to get that pickup going until UPS can come here. And then we're just gonna start barring out these next orders. We gotta keep the grind going because we're behind. We're gonna catch up today, that's for sure. All right, guys, so we are in front of the computer right now. Do not mind me if I start sniffling and stuff. It has been a pain in the ass trying to deal with this little cold. We have the package right here, and we use Pirate Ship for all of our shipping. When I say we, I mean me, obviously, you know. Package is done. Label's here. We're good to go. Let's go ahead and exit out of that. And we are going to start printing out some of the work orders that we have and what we need to get done today. So yesterday I was telling you guys, or two days ago, uh, I had closed a $4,700 deal. And I'm gonna pull that up for you guys to show you that this shit is possible. It can happen. So this is on PayPal right here, $4,700. Got that payment the other day. Payments like that are definitely possible. Do they come often? Probably not as much as I would want them to. However, they do come, so when you're ready, you know, make sure your your expenses and everything is that you, everything like that is, is calculated and totaled up completely. That way you don't lose. I'm outsourcing this order so I don't have to touch it because there's other things I could do and want to do to free time up. Yes, I could probably make like a grand more if I did it in house. However, though, time right now is is of the essence and I have to keep making that money. You know what I mean? All right, so we just finished a meeting with Bison Automation and I am happy and I am I mean, I'm so excited to use that platform. Not, um, not to mention to cut cost, but to kind of streamline everything and make it that much easier, better than what Printavo was doing. And I'm not downplaying Printavo, you know, I loved it. But you know, during these times, you gotta, you gotta double down, save money and go with the better option. And this company is fairly new and I'm just so happy to be a part of it. So more on that, we'll touch more on that probably in future videos, but for now we're back in the lab. 
I gotta fix this machine and then go from there. So let's get after it. All right, so I just need to change out the bobbin because it's just telling me that, oh, you're out of bobbin at the bottom. So that's what I need to change out. This little sickness bullshit is kicking my ass. I'm not gonna let it win though. I got two, I got two, Let's go. Just like that, back in business. And we now have to go through these boxes, go through everything. And I don't know if I'm gonna show that on camera because I gotta get on the phone with my buddy and let him know how this meeting went. But uh, I'll be back to check in with you guys in a few. I'm gonna be working in the lab a little later today. So we'll go ahead and uh, touch base real quick soon shortly peace the next day we were back in the lab guys yesterday i didn't get around to doing a lot of things because i was just so sick but i'm feeling a lot better me and espen have to run to hobby lobby to grab a shirt that i fucked up on i am super upset it's this stilo shirt right here right here but we're gonna go to hobby lobby and get another one so i'm gonna press this shirt real quick and then uh we'll get after it we'll head to hobby lobby check out this piccolo piece that i'm doing can't really tell right there but but it's coming out super, super thick. All right, guys, so we have to go to the dump right now, but I'm not going to show that part. I'm just updating you. Um, we have to go to UPS, uh, a drop-off box, just to find a little drop-off box to, uh, to drop off this package. And then uh, we got to go to Hobby Lobby, and that's when we'll connect because we got to pick out the T-shirt. Like I said, they should have Bella Canvas at Hobby Lobby. If not, for sure, they have it at uh, Joann's, and that's where we'll head next if they don't have it. So I'll uh, keep you in the loop, and I will see you at... Hobby Lobby. All right, me and Espen made it to Hobby Lobby right there. And we are gonna go inside because we need to go pick up a t-shirt. Let's go find a Bella Canvas t-shirt right now. This way, come on. They just don't have the Heather ones here. Cause that's normally what they do have. Oh, I see. Oh, that's next level. Damn it. Oh, over here, Espen. These are Gildans. Oh, these are Gildans. What the fuck? You find them? No, these are Gildans, but they feel weird. Are these the Gildan soft styles? Yep. Soft style, CBC. This is just like a Bella Canvas though. Huh. Okay, well. Look at Papa. <laughs> <laughs> well, they don't have the Bella Canvas. Man, I don't wanna go, I really don't wanna go to another store though, to be honest. We're gonna have to go to another store. All right, guys, we gotta go to Joann's because they don't have it here. Shit. All right, so we're at Michael's right now. Hopefully, I can go in here and find a Bella Canvas. Or you guys are gonna see me take an L in Michael's right now, so we'll see. All right, so we're in Michael's right now. <sighs> we're gonna try to find a t-shirt. Come on, let's go. But I don't know if we're going to be able to find one. I can't remember if Michael's has Bella Canvas. I haven't been in Michael's in so long. Paper crafts, food crafting, apparel. Let's go down here. Bella Canvas. What the hell is Make Market? Oh, here's Bella Canvas right here. Small. Come on. Give me something good. Do XL. Why are the sizes getting bigger? Going up. Brother. Do we not have black? What? No way. These are V-necks. Why, dude? Oh my gosh. Okay. Bella Canvas. 100%. 100% cotton. Woo! We were able to find one. Man. Dude, I was gonna be so pissed off right now. They got this new brand called Make Market. No clue what that is. They got the last Bella Canvas Medium right here. All right, kid, let's go. So we don't have to go to Joann's, which is awesome. We went to Michael's, we took a risk. It looks like they're gonna be phasing out Bella Canvas and putting that Make Market shirt in there. I have no clue what that is. I'm assuming it's gonna be like a dupe or something. But anyways, we are headed to a UPS drop-off box and then we're gonna head home and we got some work to do before the video is over. Peace. All right, we are back in the lab. We're about to jump into a Mike Tyson print. Let's get it. I mean, come on. That is, that's honestly really, really nice. These are super, super nice. So good. 
Yeah, damn. What? Can you see that? Like, Jesus Christ. Hit the notes all day. Woo! Look at that dirty old duck right there. Yes, these look super, super clean and they came out super, super clean. These came out absolutely phenomenal. Phenomenal cosmic power. And these are the other transfers for another company. I gotta send these to right here. It's a motorcycle club out here in Idaho. Here's that same print for them right here. Came out super clean. I still got a lot of work to do. I was supposed to have some help today, but unfortunately they canceled, but it's okay. It's not their fault. Things happen. And we got a plan for this in business. So I'm going to stop the video right here. I thank everybody for watching. We're back. We're going to be filming weekly videos once every week, every Saturday, you get a new video. And throughout this journey that I'm on, you know, I just hope you guys continue to support every Saturday, you get a new video. So make sure you like comment, favorite, subscribe. I mean, do whatever you got to do. We're going to be coming back full force on this channel. And it's not a daily vlog. It's every, like, it's a daily follow of my weekly, like, vlog compiled into one video every Saturday. So I appreciate you guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.